Hello you guys, today is another Minifigure Monday, so I will be showing you how to make a better Rey from Star Wars The Last Jedi. So I had a bit of a problem with this one because I wanted to make this arm a bit more accurate than as you see right here. And I'm actually going to start off with this arm right here because as you see the arm it has the same color as her face and you would probably want the arm to be the regular tan color because that's the same color as um, the arms are usually. So this is implying that she's sleeveless which isn't completely accurate. So I wanted to try and have it be one that is tan. And the best one that I could find for that is the one from Owen Grady from the Jurassic World Bricktober pack, which is something that a lot of people either don't have or would not want to take an arm off of a minifigure in there. So instead, I used the March Harriet's arm from the Lego Batman movie minifigure series because it still had some of the little like brown on the arm. Because if you remember from the movie, she has some a little uh, wrist thing. It's brown. And I wanted to f try and find something that's accurate to that. And the one on Owen is probably a lot more accurate. And because it's tan, it looks like that. Uh, you can see that. So that one is a bit more accurate. But I decided to go with this one in the end. Because it's going to be one that it's easier for a lot of people to obtain. So, going away from the arms, except for saying that this one I did replace with the same color as this one, which is the same color as your face, because I needed that to not be tan while that one isn't tan either. And then I just kept the regular ray hair, face, and torso, and then uh, down to the legs, I used the little armor piece from Nia from the Lego Ninjaga movie, or Season 8 or Season 9 sets. So it has the plating on it and stuff like that. But I used the underside so you can't see all that plating. Because she does kind of have her like outfit, um, like her robes kind of coming down like that. Because it kind of matches up with the design of the torso as you can see there. Like that and that. And then for the legs, I used shades from that one Ninjago pack with uh, shades Skylar and Ash. So it's a dual molded legs with, well, dual molded legs with the gray, dark gray, and the black. I would have appreciated it if that black was actually brown because that would be more accurate for her wearing like brown boots. But I felt like this is probably the closest one to what I could have used. So yeah, I, th I think those are pretty accurate. And they're actually really useful for a lot of figures that you could make those legs. And I felt like they would also be useful on this one as well. So anyway, that's pretty much it for Rey. I also gave her a lightsaber, as she would have in the movie. And anyway, that yeah, that's pretty much it for Rey. And our that wraps up this week's Minifigure Monday. Sorry I didn't have a Minifigure Monday last week. Uh, hopefully this made up for it. And anyway... Thank you guys for watching, and I will see you guys next time.